Today we are going to make a snake game. So let's start by deleting our cat. And now we paint a new sprite. Let's click on choose a sprite and then click on paint. We're going to do this in factor mode. Zoom in a lot. No, we don't want it out. Like this and no outline. So now we've drawn our rectangle, we'll use the paint to draw two eyes to set it to five is I don't want it to be so big. And our tongue as well. That's not very good. But we want it to move backwards a few layers like this by clicking on the backward a few times. Now we just group the whole thing. Which I don't think so we have to do but I prefer to do it. So now when the green flag is clicked, go to over here about that. Now we are going to use pen. Pen down, set pen color to all. We'll just set it to the same color as the snake. Whatever. Move three steps. Hit and two actually move three steps until touching touching color or touching yes. Then we'll put an all block touching color the same color of the snake. Touching H. The first thing is the second thing is we'll set ten sides. Five will be ideal, I think. Clear. Erase all. 
actually. Notice that it doesn't move. That's because that it is already touching itself. Uh, the green which has it, uh, it's itself already as the green. So we'll change it to color what is touching what. Color red. Uh, be careful, it's a bit hard to grab the red. This is black. Make sure that, that you uh, make the pore red. It's touching color green. The pen size is still a bit too thin. A bit too thin as well. So I need it to be thicker. Yes, that sounds like it. Now we'll have to need three steps. Now we'll need an if then two if thens. If key right arrow press then right arrow press then turn 90 degrees then turn clockwise 90 degrees if left arrow press then turn counterclockwise 90 degrees The reason why we somehow end up in a mess is because that we'll need a uh, weight tentil, not this weight tentil, not left arrow, mm. left arrow. I need it to point in the right direction at the start. This is one way of debugging. Somet sometimes we'll need to debug because there's an error. But just now the snake, the program didn't end. Grab a forever loop. Okay, now everything's working. Make sure that uh, you make you have the same serration and brightness. Right over here, as you can see, the serration is 100. But somehow over here, the serration is, just now the serration was 94. So now we don't need it. Everything's working fine. So now we'll have a score. So we'll just use the my variable 
fast car. Which should be in the background. Scar. When the green flag is clicked forever, set score to timer. Oh. Okay. So we just need a stop all block right there. That's 15 seconds. Anyway, I don't think so it's comfortable having a score as a decimal. Do you? So the round timer. Now the score is a whole number. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. Oh, my score was 37. That's the end of this tutorial.